because it goes back to what I remember Odin was saying. No. Again with this? <laughs> I'm sick and tired of Drakies, man. What is up, you beautiful people of YouTube? Passing the good vibes from Ohio. It is your boy, Dark Horse Rye. And as you can see, we are in the start menu for God of War Ragnarok for this episode. Now, that is because, again, I just got done finished recording the last part. This is going to be part number 20. 19 was amazing, y'all, okay? And I'm specifically hovering over the credits option on the left right now because I don't know if you guys realize or you guys know this, but when you're over the restart checkpoint, it shows you the objectives for the game and the objective for this episode had i stayed over it would have given a spoiler to the last part and i don't want to spoil that for you guys this game is an amazing game if you haven't played it yourself i would suggest playing it for yourself or if you haven't seen it i would suggest watching this series from beginning to end it's amazing i don't care what nobody says i'm not going to keep glazing it because of the fact of I just need you guys to just experience it for yourselves and whatnot, but I just want to go ahead and put that in there. So, that being said, just got done finished recording 19. We're going to go ahead and jump right into 20. Hope everyone is having an amazing, amazing day. I know mine is recording this game. And, yeah, we're just going to keep going. I'm so ready to hop back into this game, even though I just hopped from in this game. So, yeah, that being said, let's go ahead and get started, y'all. Okay, so where we headed off from last time, we are heading back home. Oh, it's just taking us straight there. I thought we were going to have a choice. I was going to try to go to Midgard and see how... Actually, no, I'm, that's Did a spoiler, so I'm not going to say anything. Before going back to no. First, we retrieve Mimir. Then you can tell us what you learned in Asgard. After that, we shall see. You really do think of him as a brother. What about Freya? Seems like she moved in while I was away. Once she turned her hatred back to Odin, she recognized our interests were aligned. Huh. I tried convincing her of that, but... When was that? Oh. Before I started telling you where I was that night. I see. Hey, she didn't kill me. I said nothing. Hmm. I forgot he didn't tell... He didn't talk about how he went and visited Freya that one time. I believe that was part... I said, I think, either in the last episode or episode before the last episode um, to go check that out. But I believe that was part six also, if I remember correctly. Hey, Bitter Squirrel. He's right there. The Anxious One isn't there, though. Let's see what we're going to be doing for this episode. You're back. How did it go? The beast should trouble us no further. Well, that's a bloody relief. So you put down old Garm, did you? Yeah. Sort of. Atreus, your decision to go to Asgard after all he's put us through. I'll never understand it. But I hope you at least came back with something we can use. I hope so, too. Come on, let me show you what Odin's up to. Here's what he cares about most. More than Ragnarok or anything, is this mask. Anyone recognize it? That thing? Ugh, oh, it's a dead end. He's been faffing around with that since before I knew him. Why is Sindri... Oh, he's mad at Atreus. Just having a laugh with that one. Okay, fine. You ain't gotta talk no. to me. Really? You're wrong, Mimir. This mask is no fraud. The giants didn't make it, and only a few of them ever glimpsed it in their visions. They never knew its origin, but some believed it was a way to gaze into the secrets of creation itself. Is it an oracle? Much, much more. Imagine becoming one with a source of infinite knowledge. This, this is why Odin tortured me. Hmm. 
So what do you think? Know it? No. It's one obsession he never saw fit to share with me. But I'll tell you this. Even when Odin speaks the truth, his purpose is false. Either way, it's a mistake to let it distract us. Oh, I thought she was going to burn the book. Our focus or not. We will rewrite our fate another way. Then I'm going back to Vanaheim. If we're not taking the fight to Odin, I should help my brother stand against him. We will join her when we can. Hmm. So what are we supposed to be doing now? Anyways. Father, I'm going to study my notes on the mask. See if I can think of a plan. But if you want to go anywhere, I'm with you. And listen, everyone. I'm really sorry about the way I left. You know I've never hurt any of you on purpose. Well, when you can turn into a bear by accident, I suppose these things can happen. So, do you forgive me? Of course, Atreus. We know you meant no harm, lad. Sandre? I'm sure I will. Eventually. Okay. Guess I'll take it. Hmm. While we're clearing the air. Oh, what do you have I to hope say? That I can be forgiven for not doing more when the Hellwalkers attacked. No. Whatever reservations I have about violence, they shouldn't apply when your home is under attack. Yes. And certainly not by undead abominations. Yes. Yet I reached for a shield instead of a sword. You were right to chide me for that, old friend. The next time the moment calls me, I'll be ready. Well said, Tia. I believe you just might. Okay, well when you do, when you do, then you'll get your God of War card back, bro. Until then, it still stays in my pocket. I can keep mine, because be I've been doing my job, Tia. You haven't been doing yours. But yeah, so we're supposed to be going to Vanaheim. You've you've had plenty I'm of time to clear your head. On this till you're ready to head out. You've had plenty of time to clear your head. What are you talking about, bro? Get out of here with that. An upgrade for the Le yes. Thank you. Okay, give me this. You already know we got to upgrade the Leviathan axe. Where is it at? Uh, oh, there it is. Now that is an axe. Yes, sir. Um, when permafrost scale Brother, is. Before we check on Freya, is there any unfinished business in other realms you wanted to take care of? I'm no. I'm sure the lad would love to help. I'm sure he would too, but not right now. Um, when the permafrost. I said I was gonna keep that. Also, while my mind is on it. I've been saying for the longest time that I was going to change this, and I kept forgetting. Okay? I kept forgetting. I really need to get this. I do. I realize that... I realize that I want to say not the last episode. I don't want to say I realized that the last episode, but I think... I think the episode before the last episode, I was like, man... I really probably need to just like get this because it increases the timing window of parries because I obviously I, I see it every time I play. I obviously want to want to parry or I try to parry and then it's like I struggle so much with parrying if that's a if that's a um right way of saying it, you know. OK, let's go to Vanaheim. Hey, wait, we're with you. I was wondering why we didn't go ahead and pick up Mimir. Now, I do want to check one thing before we go to Vanaheim. One thing. And y'all probably know what I'm going to check. But I still want to check it just to be... Not on the safe side. What's the word? Uh, Kingsgrave. 
upper wood right here upper wild woods because that's where our cabin is i want to check i need to see one thing one thing okay so i have no idea where fenrir is at this point if you haven't like looked at the last episode that's the most i can tell you i have no idea where he is they told him go home, but he can't change size, obviously, because he's if he was, I mean, if he could, he'd be back here. And like, like I said, I have no idea where I have no idea where he went. Like, is it somewhere on the map he is? Also, like, I don't, I don't know. They just told him home. And now, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. That's a turtle. Oh, that's where, uh, I think it was Charlie or something like that. That's where he was. Oh, well. Maybe I can look it up and see if I can find Fenrir anywhere around here. Either way, um... With that being said, yeah, let's go ahead, go to Vanaheim. Um, Freyr's camp. So we're not gonna start our way over there. We're gonna go to the River Delta. Well, it says Freyr's camp, which is where Great. we need to go. We gonna check in on Freya? Yes. Glad I get to come this time. I'm sure you are. So what happened the last time you were in Vanaheim? I still don't know how you got Frey to stop trying to kill you. We traveled to her village to break Odin's spell. Once freed, she accepted that I was not her enemy. You also missed a highly entertaining moment where Brock was lifted ass over face in Freyr's camp. You met Freyr? What's he like? Different from his sister. Lacks her conviction. True. But he's a bit quicker to forgive. And an ineffective leader. But his heart's in the right place. You'll like him, lad. I was about to say, why y'all explain all this to him when you could just let him meet him? Wow. It's beautiful. And, uh, wet. It is also dangerous. More dangerous than hell? Hmm. Freya's camp is to the right. No to rush, right. is that? Not every day the lad gets to see a new realm. Yep, sure is a rush. We got stuff we got to take care of. Freya's camp then. Time to see how the Vanir have fared in our absence. I hope Freya's okay. She can care for herself. We're still checking on her though? Her brother's forces are outnumbered. And there is much I owe her. <laughs> see, Kratos is a real one. He really is. Oh, we can get over here now. Oh, well, would you look at that? Huh. I wonder what this is. I don't think I've seen a blue chest before. Unless it's just dependent on the region. That's the other half of the broken moose behind seed we found. We can take it to a mystic gateway. Maybe we'll find Sutter's combat trials. Oh, boy. It's... <sighs> I was hoping it was going to be something else, but hey, I guess that'll be part of the, the final last favors, the part two for that. Where is everyone? Stay alert. I don't like this, brother. You know what? Now that he said that, I did not realize there was no talking or commotion. Until just now. Is that the dog? Kratos, Atreus, a welcome reunion. Unexpected, but welcome. Hey, Morgan Freeman, what you got going on? You know us? Can't be. Is that who I think? 
Looks like it, Mimir. shifty bastard. It's almost good to see you again. And for once in the shape of a man. Or nearly. So that's how they got your head out of your ass. Maybe now you'll stop being such a half-blind, piss-drunk, oversexed liar. He was more of a pig than I ever was. I do not know you. He said I do not recognize your handiwork. Hildes Vini. Remember when we first met Frey in the woods? Hmm? After I... Oh, I am so, so sorry about he that. He was the pig. Her yeah. And friend. Counselor to the Vanir. And yes, while exiled at Midgard, I was trapped in my boar form. And then you shot me. At my command. No. My arrow, my mistake. Forgotten. Vanaheim needs our help more than ever. Even Mimir's. Come. Just watch where you aim that bow of yours. My hide's not so thick in this form. And excuse me to the people who are probably saying a, a bear, a, a boar is it. something totally where different from a pig. I have a favor to ask. I'll explain on the way. Another favor. But yeah, excuse me to the people who probably like a boar is, is, is entirely different than a, a pig, bruh. I don't care. This is a game. Chill out. I'm trying to have fun. Where's Freya? She came here to help her brother. She leads the search party for Freya and Bigvir. They've been captured by the Ainher Yard. Of course they were. An ambush. The presence has intensified since your last visit. To make matters worse, the Celestial Wolves haven't been seen in days. Or at least I assume. Not easy, tracking time with no moon in the sky. No moon. Just like in their shrine. Their shrine? It's a long story. You want us to check on them? You have my gratitude. We're spread thin. And if anyone can help Skoll and Hati, he'd be a fellow giant. Very well. Freya mentioned you had a way past this. You don't disappoint. Continue down this path and you'll find their den. Good luck. Oh. Don't shoot any boars. <laughs> Do you think he's really forgiving me for shooting him? No. Trust me, lad. The old swine still carried a grudge. You'd know it. What happened between you two? The usual. Miscommunication, conflicting loyalties, broken promises. Nothing to concern yourself with. I'm not concerned. Just curious. Curiosity's all well and good. But so is privacy, huh? Okay, okay. Point taken. Yeah, which I would talk which I kept talking about with secrets and everything. Aya. Boy, if you don't get out that acid, I took two hits and you sound like you taking a whole bunch more right now. Landscaper is what that thing just said. Honey. I was joking when I said honey. I'm not even gonna lie. Oh crap, crap, oh crap, crap. Oh. Hmm. Oh no, 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 no. Oh wait. I forgot those what those are. Oh, 
I got quiet for a second. I didn't even realize it until just now. They probably got so different from the other realms. Warm, like Spartalfarm. But there's a kind of thickness in the air. Hmm. Egros. Uh what? Egros. Greek. For humid. Egros. I like it. Is this the first time he's taught him Greek? Well, I guess I guess that actually does kind of make sense, not gonna lie. What point does he have to learn Greek? If he's probably not ever gonna really go there. Well no, even then it would be good for him to learn this culture. He say the Nokins. Oh yeah, no 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 no, yeah, come here. Go, go ahead and deal with y'all off rip. Uh oh, uh oh, explosion! I knew it was gonna happen, bro. Nope, we're not doing it, we're not doing it, we're not doing it. Take the L, take the L, take the L, take the L. I'm not doing it. I knew it was gonna happen, bro. I just knew it. I just did. I just. I felt it as soon as my health got down to red. I knew it was gonna happen. The Nokia's making these things stronger! Nope. Find you! Incoming! Come here! Cause it's like if I don't deal with these jokers like off rip, they're gonna become a problem. Off the jump. And I don't want that that happen. It's been a while since I used that ability, I believe. Stay back. No, where did you come from? Yep, nope. Nope. Where did I take? Probably from the acid, I'm sure. Back up. Where you at? Yep. Mm, mm. Combos. All right. Hey, there you are. We're here. Stay alert. Wonder where they went. Eaten by a Nokin, perhaps. You know, lad. This excursion into Vanaheim means you've now visited each of the nine realms. Huh. Guess you're right. Not many mortals can claim such a feat. Not many gods either. Even your father has yet to grace the halls of Asgard. I'm in no hurry to do so. Hildas Vini said Freyr and Bigvir were captured. Who's Bigvir? He's a light elf, a former scholar exiled from Alfheim with his wife Bela. She may be their best warrior. Why was he exiled? You'll have to ask him for the full tale. But I take it that he and Bela's quest to unite their people was frowned upon. Wait, Bela's a dark elf? Wow. That raises even more questions. Hope he's okay. I thought Big Fear was that light elf, but I couldn't remember. Y'all hear that crunching noise, right? How much you want to bet it's a, vo a wolver? How much you want to bet it's a wolver? Guarantee it's a wolver. 
Oh, wait a second. I called it, didn't I? I called it. That's one. That's two. There's a third one around here. It's probably where he's at. Oh, so you got a little bit smart. Mm -mm. Yes. That's the easiest I've ever beaten a wolver. Ever. Ragnarok begins when Skull and Hati catch the sun and moon, right? I said it was foretold, lad. Prophecy. Which after our time with the Norns, we all had quite enough of. But Odin still believes. That's gotta be why the Inner Yard stole the moon. He's still trying to avoid Ragnar. Or prepares for it. Fights a proxy war in this realm to distract his enemies. Yeah. Or that, I guess. Wait a minute. Aha! There we go. I'm glad I didn't have to do much to figure that out. Okay, one more. There we go. What's this? Another horn. No, I need I need health. I need an apple. Give me an apple, bro. Give me la manzana so I can upgrade my health. I can sense them up there. It's gotta be their den. Excited to meet Skull and Hearty, lad. I mean, I've heard all your stories. It's gonna be weird meeting them in person. Legend meeting reality. At the very least, it shouldn't fail to entertain. He said he can, oh, cause they're giants. I was like, he said he can feel them. How is that possible that they're giants? So that makes sense. Oh. Uh, hello? I think they're sleeping. Well, there you have it. The legendary celestial wolves. Supremely entertaining, as promised. Remember their shrine? They didn't rejoin the sky until after the moon returned. And then chased an arrow across the sky. Right. Well, guess we go find the moon and put it back where it belongs, eh? As if that's a perfectly normal thing to say. He's right about that. How do you steal the moon? The Aenor Yar played a part according to Skull and Hati Shrine. Managed to stuff the moon inside a box, if memory serves. But it didn't say where they took the box. Aye, that's the rub of using prophecy as a map, isn't it? A bit sparse on the details. There's a war camp in the nearby village. A strong fortress to guard their bounty. We will try there first. I know I asked that question, how did they steal the moon? I know somebody was thinking... I know there's a Despicable Me reference in there somewhere. I know somebody already Just used that. Not my <laughs> army, really. Although Beer Girl was a soldier, <laughs> once walking the path of a traveler. I imagine he's handy with that enormous <laughs> broken sword of his. A traveler that doesn't want to kill us. That's nice. I heard, I heard the squish and I still didn't stop, bro. I heard the squish and still didn't think think about it. I was like, what's that squishing noise? And I didn't even think about it, bro. I just kept walking. Ain't out of your head. I'm ready. No. 
Oh, okay. I thought it was one of those um, witches. Surprise! Really? You know what? It's all right. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, yes. Oh, that's a new one. No, ma'am. Mm. Careful, brother. You're in yep. Mm, yes. I think I said this in the last episode, but that wrath is like a good mixture between. What's up? Did you see that? Oh my gosh. I didn't know that do that. A new enemy. Stay alert. Yeah? Correct. Oh my gosh, a new a new mm. one. Fitting. Probably a new one that's gearing to make me mad. But what I was saying was that What I was saying was it's a good mix between There she is again. Valor and Wrath. I, I mean, Fury. No here. They hide. The Vanir aren't all hardened warriors like our dear Freya. Those who survive the warfare find it easier to hide in the jungle and use nature as their shield. Hmm. Where are you at? Because I hear you. You would not think seeing a glowing bird would be the hardest thing to see but sometimes it is which doesn't make any sense and even then okay here we go there it is wait no I thought that was him it's not Oh, whatever. I'm not going to spend my time looking for that bird. Not this time. I already uh, found one, so I'm cool. Empty. Where'd they all go? Invisible. Wait, there's the moon. Uh, box? Down there. That's got to be it. This is definitely an ambush. Yes. <laughs> Where do y'all see a box at? Wait. You can get to it from up here. Uh. Oh. oh, I was about to say. Well, that's where I was going initially, and then. Look out! Oh. Yep. Ooh, come here. Uh -uh. Mm. Yep, you don't like it when the, your ability is used against you now, do you? Oh no, don't run! Oh, I forgot I had that ability. Nope. Mm hmm. That's what we see. Oh, wait, that was probably stupid, but you know what? It's all good. Gone. Ooh, nice try. Uh -huh. 
Huh? How? It's fine. It's fine. I can get my health back. Uh huh. Long range people can get on my last one. Mm, nice try. But no dice. My parries are getting a little bit better. At least for the time being. I don't think Asgard's running out of soldiers anytime soon. My parries have gotten just a, a little bit better. I'm not even gonna front. And I know that's because I got the the shield rond I got now. Ready to put the moon back where it belongs? Okay. Yeah. That is a weird thing to say. <sighs> hey! Hurry! She's getting away! Uh, Come on! I, I feel that, Kratos. I really do. Double ambush? Okay. Didn't see that coming. In the water. Thank you. Give me my health back. She's gone again. Hurry. We got to get across. Um, okay. No. There we go. Atreus, wait up, man. There. He's going up the waterfall. Well, I used that way too early. Or I guess I used it at the right time. Still up there. Another ambush? Really? That times the charm. They are not smart. I understand that. You know. What we're doing right now, all of this, it's almost exactly how we saw it play out back in Skull and Hati Shrine. The wolves are back in Vanaheim. We're rescuing the moon. Yes, I remember the prophecy. So, doesn't it make you worried? If everything we're doing now happened in the Yotnar Shrine? Remember our agreement. Prophecy will not dictate our actions. Yeah. Our allies need help. What is that? A wyvern, nasty beast. Oh Your my gosh. Fight flight. Bring your tail here. Oh, yep. Did I just counter that? I don't know. Ooh, yes. Ooh, come here. That was nasty work right there. That was some nasty work. And I didn't even need to use that. That's fantastic. That's fantastic. I didn't use up my Berserker Stone. And I didn't need to um use that little it's cold. helpful element, I'll say. It's from Helheim. Timed almost to grab this while I freed Garm. What is it? <sighs> I was there, but I, I didn't know. And now you fight to undo the damage. Your guilt is misplaced. Yeah. No, you, you're right. We can return to the den through here. They will pursue. Keep your guard up. Father, how are you so sure we even have a choice about what we're doing? Doubt is a weakness we cannot afford. Who said anything about doubt? 
So far, we've done everything the giant said we would. We make our own choices. Nothing forces us. Hmm. He ain't lying. I mean, even if they are, even if they are following a prophecy, he is technically right about that in the sense that if if they're continuing to follow the path they're on, mm, 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 it's because they're deciding to stay on the path, not because they're choosing to. You know? Okay. Guess what? Not anymore. And I got my health back. Thank you. What is doing all this? What if we're walking straight into Ragnarok? Isn't there any way to avoid fate? Your fate? What if we can't stop you from... Would you turn your back on the wolves? On this realm? Remember our agreement? What's gonna happen? Because something tells me that he's gonna... He's gonna go back on the agreement if not and if not does make some good points though as long as Atreus lives so be it hmm Does nothing. Just like inside their shrine. Oh, that's beautiful. An eclipse. If I do this, fate mm. only binds you if you let it. Do what is necessary, not because it is written. See? Because that goes back to the whole boulder getting killed because of senseless violence. Because they basically said the fates, the Norns said Good choice, lad. that because Freya didn't accept that she because she tried to prevent it that's what made it happen by her trying to prevent it it basically made they have a gift for us a way to call them anytime we need them as i was trying to say because i really don't want to do anything right now hold up basically what i'm trying to say is that freya you know because she tried to prevent boulder's death she unintentionally set it in motion that it was going to happen because she drove him mad by trying to keep him from everything happening to him what is this oh have i really used that ability that much actually yeah i can believe that i actually can't believe that so um what do we want to use greatly increases maelstrom charge gain from the skill um, you know, greatly increases resistance to damage and being scared. Ah, uh, st uh, I can't talk. Staggered by skill. 
and then we'll just go ahead and equip that and i just do protection just because of the fact of it's probably not easier for me to do it that way but it's probably better that i use it for protection since i feels like they want us to use it at one of the altars <laughs> perhaps freya will know so in essence they just gave us the keys of dusk till dawn not bad for a day's work we should head back to Hilda's Finney and tell him about all this. Yeah? Yes. Back to the camp. Okay. Well, I guess we'll talk to... Look out! I guess we'll talk to... Look out for what? Yalla! I guess we'll talk to Hilda's Finney. And then end the episode off there. Depending on... Uh-huh. Depending on what happens after that. Yep. It was very, very egros. Liking it less now. Okay. That wasn't the same one from earlier, was it? No. They come back fast. Not that fast. In Asgard, what else did you see of Odin's army? Well, all these Anhuryar we've been fighting, they've already died in battle once. We kill them here, and they'll just wake back up in Valhalla. They never truly die. Should it come to war, we do well to have our own endless army of dead soldiers. You mean Helheim's army, like the prophecy said. It will not come to that. Hmm. Honestly, that makes sense what he's talking about. Because it goes back to what I remember Odin was saying. No! Again with this? <laughs> I'm sick and tired of Drakey's man. Every time we come to, Every time we come to this stupid realm, it's Drakey's. Every time! Well, at least I don't think both of them are wild. I think both of them are just water types. No, nope, we're going to deal with one. Then we go after the other one. Just like last time. No! Okay, yeah, we got through one. We got through one. Good, good, good. No, get your tail out that water. Get out the water. Playing with you. Oh no! Now he's developed electric abilities. on oh come on yes father son tag team again no again with the button yes they like the egros you really like using that word Oh, 
Artillery of the Ancients Hurl. Okay, raining down multiple spears. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and get that. Can't upgrade it yet, so that's fine. Chaos Flame. Okay, so we can upgrade the Blades of Chaos again. We can get across from up here. Oh my gosh, bro. Oh, wait. So, we report back to Hildes Fini. Then what? We came here to help Freya. We will not leave without rescuing her brother and the Light Elf. Okay, but Odin's not going to stop searching for mask pieces. That is his concern, not ours. Sure, but if that mask offers all the answers... Then it will surely exact a price. Be wary of shortcuts to knowledge. Yes, Father. You are not lying about that. <laughs> that is honestly the truth. <clears throat> Shortcuts may seem like a good idea, but a powerful axe throw that returns with a devastating impact. Kratos is fully protected while shielding. Wait, what? Boom. That's the fog of Thimble Winter. That's not what we were looking at. Oh, it's saying it's in there. Oh, wait, he uses it. He throws it and... Then he shields, or do we shield? I guess is the question. I'm gonna try it out. I'm gonna try it out, and I'll upgrade it. Probably was stupid, but you know what? Whatevs. And I didn't even realize that we only had one. I didn't even realize we only had one um heavy ability for that. And we have like what three, four? For the blades of chaos. Do all the plants you want to kill us? No, no. <laughs> Only the carnaptious ones. Only the what? Carnaptious? <laughs> that is a word I never thought I would learn today. <laughs> okay, we're going this way. Oh. That? Ah, that wrinkly mug belongs to Helka. She's a blossinder. Hounds mm. prized for their pinpoint mm. accurate tracking abilities. Mm. You'll love her. She is big and pudgy. Kratos, Atreus. That eclipse was your doing, I take it. Thank you for coming. Big Vir used the diversion to escape. What about your brother? We know where they're holding him now. Vale has already prepped the explosives. If you're with me, we can leave as soon as you're ready. I could use another shapeshifter's help. Go with him, Atreus. I will aid Freya. Yes, sir. Oh. I can't. About Thirty heartbeats. That's enough. Once you see the signal, count it down. So thirty seconds, basically. Come, we should get moving. <laughs> can't believe we missed this. What is she talking about? Multiple high protection, force and the fires that could be slotted in the amulet. Idrisil. I can stoke the fires of those chain blades for you. Oh yeah, we did get a chaos flame. What you need now? Go ahead. Hot blades coming up. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Level five, baby. Level five. And okay. Now for the goddess. And still nothing. For? Still nothing different for this stuff. And it happened when we. It happened when we got the dog on. Um. What you call him? When we got the drop mirror spear. Well, I guess we're just going to go insane because that thing is just going to sit there on the bottom of that tree. And I see that right now. We're just going to lose it. That's you are. Please hush. Um, we're just, we're just going to lose it. I see. So, um, what did that say? 
Oh, that's the thing that we can't do anything about. Okay. So, well... Hitting the road or chewing the fat? Well, in that case, since we have basically done all of that, I am going to cut this episode of God of War Ragnarok part number 20 right there. Um, honestly, I'm not even going to front. I think this has been probably one of the best episodes combat wise that I've had in a long time. Um, probably since the beginning of the game, if I had to take a, uh, a wild guess, because I think we only went down once this episode, like combat wise, this has been the best episode so far. I think we only went once and even then we did not use a rage stone. So not a rage stone, but a resurrection stone. So, with that being said, we don't have to spend money on a Resurrection Stone, and, um, I would say that means our combat ability has improved. But I feel like that's also because we used the Rond of Deflection that I said that I was going to be start using, that I said I was going to start using like two or three episodes ago. Um, so yeah, I'm glad we have that now, because I do believe it really improved my combat ability on top of the fact though that I used um, a lot more like combos and I leveled my character up and whatnot or level Kratos up and whatnot also uh, Atreus is a combat ability as well so yeah that's basically uh, what I have to say about that but we got to meet Skull and Hockty and that eclipse was an amazing experience. I'm going, y'all probably already know this. I'm going to use that as my thumbnail. I already know I'm going to use this as my thumbnail. So, might as well get ready for that. Um, so, uh, if you made it to this far into the video, then you probably know that I'm going to use that as my thumbnail. So, yeah, with that being said, um, yeah, that's it. Next episode, we're going to be rescuing Freya, Freya's brother. Br brother? Brother. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why I just cut that out just now, but we're going to be rescuing her brother. I don't know. Well, they said the Angel Yard got them, so I guess that answers that question. But there's no way that it wasn't planned by somebody higher up because the Angel Yard, obviously, like they said, are kind of brainless and don't think. So whoever it was that made the call, we have to know who it was. And I guess we'll figure that out next episode. So, yeah. Um... And it was good meeting Hilda Sfini as well for this episode, knowing that he was the boar, the boar in the first game that Atreus shot and whatnot. But either way, so yeah, just a lot of interesting stuff this episode. Um, besides the fact of the eclipse, you know, just a lot of interesting stuff that I found interesting and what. So yeah, with that being said, that's going to be the end of this part of God of War Ragnarok. You already know what to do if you guys enjoyed. Leave a like, leave a comment. Subscribe to see the end of this journey. Once it comes about, once we get there, and enjoy the hype that we're going to have at the same time. So, yeah. On that note, y'all, I am out. Y'all stay blessed, stay breezy, keep being cheesy with your bunch of goofball selves. Keep taking it easy. Well, continue to take it easy, I guess. Is what I should say more like. And I will see you beautiful people in the next episode. Love you guys. I will see you later. Don't worry, Freyr. We are coming to get you, my potential brother-in-law, depending on how they decide to take a turn with the series.